In this question, it says there are three spheres whose radii is three, four, and five centimeter. They are melted to form a single sphere, right? And we have to find this radius of that new sphere. So what we know, there are three spheres. Let's say this be the first sphere of radius three centimeter, the other being four centimeter, and the third whose radius is taken as five centimeter. Right. These spheres are melted to form a big sphere. Now, what you should know here that uh, whenever we do so, like whenever we melt one sphere and transform into different shape, right? any, any solid shape when it is melted and uh, reformed or recast into a new shape, its volume remains same. So let's say Whatever be the volume in this case, let's say V1 is the volume of this, V2 be this, V3 be this. So if I add these three volume, that should give us the volume of this large sphere, which I'm taking as V only. What else we know? We know the radius of this R1 as say three centimeter, this being R2 as four centimeter. This is R2 and this being say R3 I've taken as five centimeter and I can take this as capital R which is equal to what we have to find. Now what we can do here we can replace this v1 with the formula of a sphere and that is four over three pi r I'm taking r as r1 right and this the other one this is four over three pi r2 cube plus four over three pi R3 cube is equal to the volume of this sphere whose radius is capital R, 4 over 3 pi capital R cube. So do not place the value in this stage. Instead, you should take 4 by 3 pi as common. So I can write this as R1 cube, this as R2 cube, this being R3 cube, and that is equal to 4 over 3 pi capital R cube. Now what we can see here, these four by three pi and four by three pi get canceled. So now we can place this value. I'm replacing R1 with this, R2 with this, and R3 with this. So R1, which is three, so three cube is 27. R2, which is four, so four cube is 64. R3, which is five, so five cube is 125, and that is equal to capital R cube. Now the sum of this is 216. This is 216 is equal to R cube. That implies R is six because the cube of six is 216. Now we must use the unit here. So we should write that this is six centimeter. And that's how this question can be done.